Yates. <laughs> I'm Lucas Eats. And today we have so much in store. French fries. Oh. No way. A Nutella pizza. Lucas Joyner. No, you mm. didn't. And what else? Oh, Lucas Joyner. Good morning from France. It is like seven o'clock. We made it in pretty late last night, but honestly, I couldn't sleep because I'm just too excited to be here. Woke up pretty early, made myself a big jug of water, and I've been sitting out on the patio. Let me show you. Our host left a lot of books, and I found this French verb, so I've been reading that. And sitting out here on our little patio and just admiring. It's kind of gloomy right now, but when the sun comes up over there, it's so pretty. But yeah, if you're new here, I am Brindley Joyner, and this summer we are traveling Europe. We just got back from Majorca. So if you haven't watched that vlog, definitely go back and watch that. But this vlog is going to be a week in the south of France. So I'm so excited to explore and take you guys along with me on the vlog. Make some good memories together. I'm starting by walking down to find a little grocery store to get almond milk because I want to make a coffee at our Airbnb. Almond milk, Lucas is stretching on the floor. But we did get a reusable bag full of some random groceries. Let's do a little haul. I love these little juices, so I got six of these. And then this was the only milk I could find. It's coconut milk, so Ooh, hopefully that's good. That's my favorite. I got some micellar water, shampoo, some apples, an orange, and these little guys. I love grocery stores in other countries, so I definitely wanted to check it out. But in all honesty, when we travel, we just eat out the whole time, so it's kind of a waste to get groceries too. So we just got some snacks and things to tide us over before we start eating at bakery and stuff. I'm gonna put this away, sit out, and get to work a little bit on my computer, and we'll catch you when Mary Margaret and Noah arrive from the airport in like an hour. Mary Margaret and Noah just arrived in their Uber, so we're gonna go down Let's the go. stairs and help them get up. We have to go up three flights of stairs with lots of bags, so it's definitely a full group effort. I'm so excited for them to see it here. <laughs> He's literally trucking it. Up three flights. <laughs> they made it here and we're packing up now. We just did a little bit of scheduling and we're gonna go find food first and then sit at a coffee shop and work. Today's gonna be like our busy work day to get everything ready for a launch, which is launching in tomorrow or two days? Two days. Two days. Two days and work for a little bit and then and kind of explore the town. So let's pack up and go get some food. Nauseous. We've been sitting for seven hours straight, but it was very necessary because Honey Launch is in two days. So we've just been working on everything in here, but we're starving and we're gonna go walk back to get Thai food and then head back to the house for a call and have an early night because I think we're waking up for sunrise tomorrow to shoot a little bit more. Exhausted, but we're gonna go see sunrise down on the beach. We went to bed at like 12 last night and I woke up at 4 30 But it's gonna be worth it because I think the sunrise is gonna be very glowy very pretty and we'll see what we get into We are shooting one more little shoot for honey So I'm shooting this bandeau today and then really we just want to see an actual sunrise in the water here So we're getting it out early <laughs> the way the blues in 
This is what it looks like to swim at 5.30 a.m. in Nisrit. So beautiful. Take a stand, move your hand someday. In your eyes, no disguise. website for a long time <laughs> we're all brain dead right now because we've just been staring at the screen but we finally convinced the boys to take a little work break and go to the beach so we're gonna go meet Haley and Grace and sit down on the beach and get some sunshine finally because look how pretty it is outside the blue skies are out Don't even know if you'll be able to hear me out there. <gasps> there's a spider, there's a spider. Oh no, you see him? Okay, we can shut that. Anyways, we are going to a dinner. Oh, I haven't talked to you guys for a bit. We went for a very fun little beach day and met up with Haley and Grace, our friends there, and swam, tan, read. I read my book this way and I got a gnarly tan line from my necklace, so that's great. But I just got ready with a little bit of makeup and we're going to Le Plungler, Le Plungler. I'm always saying names wrong, so I'll put the name on the screen, but it's this gorgeous restaurant that I've had on my bucket list to go to for dinner and drinks forever now. It's beautiful. So we're gonna meet up with friends for that and then I'm hoping we get gelato after, walk around the town a little bit and we'll see what we get into. Okay, we just made it to la 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 and we are all dressed up. This is probably the fanciest we've all looked together. Uh oh, sorry. So we're gonna so go walk around for a little bit until our reservation at nine. Also, it's almost nine o'clock and like this is like so bright. guys it's the next day i have to be a little bit quiet because people are still sleeping but today is launch day of honey swim by the time this is live honey swim will already have been live for like two weeks i think but in real time right now in this moment it's about to be live today first two days i've been just kind of like chilling around here because we've been working so much but as soon as we launch after this then it's free for all and we get to like actually go out and have fun and like do venture stuff here, so I'm really excited for that too. Our plan today is to work in the morning, maybe go to a little beach club, hang by the pool, and then our posting time is at 6 p.m. tonight. So after we post, we'll see. <laughs> we might need to celebrate. For now, we're just drinking morning coffee. Okay, it's time to shoot all of the try on haul stuff because we're launching at six tonight. So we're literally putting on every single bikini we have, filming, talking about it, doing all the behind the scenes to put it on stories and stuff. This is gonna take quite a bit, but <laughs> it's the last big task we have. And then after that, it's pretty much go 
showtime. We're making the boys do a TikTok with with the swimwear on. <laughs> this is what y'all look like. I just want y'all to know. Like. <laughs> Oh my god. Oh, waiting! <laughs> what? <laughs> what? <laughs> what? <laughs> I feel loud! <laughs> oh, so they brought us the sweetest <laughs> little things. Flowers oh, so and croissants. Okay, launch went incredible. It was so much fun. We were just sitting there watching all the little dots go across different parts of the world. And this is, I think, the first company that we initially did international shipping with. So that was so cool to just see it going everywhere. And a huge thank you to everybody who ordered and supported and posted on stories and everything. Like, y'all absolutely made our day. It went so good. And now we're gonna take a break from the computer screens because our eyes are all just fried. And we're gonna go down and jump in the ocean, go for a little sunset swim, and then go up and try to find food somewhere. Stellar day. And honestly, I'm just really excited for it to be like the work days over because after this we get to actually really explore and go to different cities and do all the fun things in France. Are, well, it's the next morning. Good morning, and we are heading down to the port. I made a huge mistake, and I booked us a reservation on this ferry to go to Saint Tropez, but I didn't read the fine print that you have to pay the day before in person. So yesterday we were looking at the reservation, and we were like, "Oh my gosh, we needed to pay at 5 p.m." And we definitely did not do that. So we're gonna go down there and basically beg them to let us on this boat and hope that it happens. So I guess you'll see what they say. We did lunch and shopped around a little bit and now we're finally heading to the beach to go check out the ocean and jump in the water. It's gonna feel so good because it's actually very hot here today. Okay, you guys, this day on the trip was actually my most favorite. We started with breakfast and then we did this coastal walk. It's kind of like a mini hike, but it really gave us a chance to see all of the beauty of the coastline. I kind of forgot to intro it this morning, so I just wanted to fill you guys in before we got into it. All right, so we just made it onto this little trailhead and it's really just like a coastal walk slash hike, but look at that view. And basically we're just gonna walk along the coast all the way up to another city. Let's do this.
finally found a little place to jump in and we swam for a little bit, took out the honey goggles. Now we're gonna head back up this like little stair route to get on the main road to try to still get back to the French Surma. <laughs> I keep saying it wrong. But whatever that town is that we headed out to try to get to. Look at this little spot we're tanning on right now. Oh. like swimming and everything at this little spot. This is where we've been for the last couple of hours. And the sun is starting to set a little bit. What time is it? Do we know? Oh, so we still got like two hours. But we're gonna go back and Uber into our little part of town and then we're gonna go get some food and just see what the evening brings us. I know I'm starving and I need to shower because this hair is crazy. We all got so much sun, but it was such a fun day. This was honestly probably my favorite day of me so far because we actually got outside in nature and got to swim a lot and dive down and do all the things we love. So, muy bueno. It is our last full morning here and today we're going to Antibes, which has been like on our to-do list the whole trip. So we're finally getting to it the last day. Swim around Billionaire's Bay, explore the town and just figure it all out. But I'm really excited. It's going to be a fun day. I'm wearing this little orange set today and we're about to head to breakfast and get on to the train. Take your first bite, boy. <laughs> Good? <laughs> jumping at Billionaire's Bay and now I'm a you heard it here first and then or and now we're walking back up this little mountain thing to try to find an uber into old town Antibes we saw that there's just like shops and restaurants and stuff around there maybe a little beach and we're gonna go check that out and get a little snack we also did not pack waters at all so we were like parched today so water snacks beach and we'll take you along Beaches. Oh, guys. We went into a grocery store and kind of went savage mode on snacks. There's meat and some fruits, and we're just having a little snack right here on the road. Got some new shoes. Let's see them. Ooh, those are so sick. I love. My, my poochie got them for me. This is the store. You guys ever want to get the same shoes? Uh, 
Talante and Thieves. We got little friendship rings at this little place. The um, shop that we went in. And it was so fresh in there. They had a lot. They had a lot of like gold jewelry and cute little beachy pieces, but that is gorgeous. This is our last day here and the time has just absolutely flown by. Right now we are leaving for the airport in like five hours. So we're just spending the day working in coffee shops, walking around and getting the last couple hours in of the pretty city. I'm on a walk by myself right now, just taking it all in one last time and looking around and just saying goodbye to another place that I've fallen in love with. But I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I hope it was really fun to watch and maybe you got some good recommendations if you ever come here. Thank you so much for being a part of it and we'll see you on the next vlog. Goodbye, niece. I'll miss you. <laughs> Right, right, right. And Lily Shelly, baby. <laughs>